Hey guys, Tarko Cyclone FPV, and I was just doing something for someone on a uh, setting up a special function for their um, radio so that when they turn the dial, their S1 switch. Now they were using an X9 Lite. I used an X9D Plus. I'm going to stick with the X9D Plus. Let me just show you what I'm working with here. So it's the same process, except you only have one dial on this side, which is your S1 switch, and here this is S1, S2. But in either case, we did it to add a special function for you to be able to turn the volume control with this, right? Uh, but somebody mentioned here that it'd be better, you know, it'd be good to do it with a global function. That way it covers the entire radio, all models, instead of just that one. And that's right. He's actually spot on with that. So I'm going to show you how to do that real quickly as well. So in this case, the only difference is you're going to go to menu, hold that down. Then you start getting your menu screen. You just uh, click your page button. And then you're going to get to something called global function. Instead of special functions, the same thing, but it covers the entire uh, model spectrum that you have in here, not just the one model you're working on. So here we're going to hit GF1. And we're going to hit our enter key. And here we're going to hit our enter key again. And we're going to... now. I told him, uh, you know, use your switch. I pick a switch that you either don't use and it'll be that position, or you can pick a, um, a switch that you toggle, right? So in this case, uh, I don't use, um, I don't use, let's say, uh, my SH switch, right? I don't, I don't use it. So in this position right now, which is down position, I'm going to use that. That way, if I never move it, this is going to be a valid function that's always active, right? So SH, we're going to leave it down right there. And then I'm going to come over and I'm going to go to my. Um, uh, where is it? Volume somewhere here. Volume right there. Hit enter. Come over here. Click that. And I'm going to turn my S1. And that's all it is. I'm going to come over here and I'm going to put check mark. Okay. Now, what you're going to notice is no matter what now, you see my volume control right here, right? If you, if you look at the icon right there, I turn it up. It goes up. I turn it down. It goes down. So I'm using the dial, right, to adjust it. Okay. So if you can see, I'll try to get it all on the screen and zoom in. So if you can see now, I can adjust my settings like this by using a global function and that will actually carry through any model I'm in. So if I go to menu and I go down to the next model and I click select model, right, my global function still works. So if you want to use the function on every model and not just that one, which I probably should have thought about and I appreciate the, the guy who on the vi uh, YouTube video who mentioned that, it would have been better to do a global function than a, uh, a special function in that model. So this is how you do it as a global function to cover all the models uh, uh, that you have on your radio, okay? All right, guys, that's, it's a real quick video. Uh, I just wanted to, um, Oops, let me do this. There you go. I just want to make sure I got that covered as well. Thank you uh, for the gentleman that mentioned that. Uh, and to everybody else, if you have any questions, again, as always, find us on our uh, Facebook groups page at facebook.com forward slash groups forward slash cycling uh, Otherwise, please support us on YouTube and please subscribe. Oh, sorry, YouTube and Facebook, right? Okay, that's it, guys. Sorry. I'm, I was loopy. It's a Sunday. I'm going to go spend time with my kids now. I'll shout out to you all later. Be safe. Stay flying. Peace.